Thanks, guys. Today is also a big day for young St. Louis athletes. A new sports complex in Chesterfield. They're going to have a ribbon cutting a little bit later this morning. All right, Fox 2's Laura Simon live there now with a closer look at what's inside of the state-of-the-art facility. Good morning to you, Laura. Good morning to you, Blair and John. It's opening day, if you will, here out at the Chesterfield Sports Complex, as this is said to be the largest indoor volleyball and basketball facility in the entire region. That, according to the Chesterfield Sports Association, I just got done speaking with their general manager, and he's super excited for this, as you can imagine. This is expected to bring around 900,000 visitors to the area, so it's also great for the area economy as well. They officially broke ground back in in August, they did experience some delays because of the historic July flooding that we had. But the Chesterfield Sports Complex is a 97,000 square foot facility here on Etherton Road in Chesterfield. A thousand youth athletes are expected to practice here each week, and 2,500 athletes are expected to play in tournaments on the weekends. Developers say this will be a major economic driver as it is expected to generate $3.6 million in annual local spending. Nearly 20 major regional and national sporting events, including martial arts, arts and gymnastics meets are already scheduled here in the coming weeks. It has nine basketball courts, which convert to 18 volleyball courts. They're equipped with Olympic level flooring. Other amenities include a fitness area, full food service operations and multi-purpose rooms for teams, meetings and classes. The general contractor on the project is Keystone Construction Company and the developer is Mia Rose Holdings. So the ribbon cutting for this complex set to take place here really soon here at nine this this morning you can expect us to be there and bring you more video of this big day throughout the day here but they are pretty much booked up for quite some time with various tournaments and events going on for the season reporting live here in chesterfield this morning laura simon fox 2 news